Hey fans, welcome to Math with McMurdo. I hope you enjoy these videos. The school auditorium, there are 33 seats in each row of seats. How many rows are needed for 528 students to each have a seat? That is why we can't have some on the floor because it says they each have to have a seat. There is no putting them on the floor. They may not sit on other people's laps. It's just not happening. So Emmett, what do you think we should do to solve this very problem? 528 divided by 33. Okay, estimate, what do you want to estimate this to, Cole? 530 divided by? No, 510 divided by 30. Okay, 500 divided by 30 would be what? 531 divided by 30. 531 divided by 30. What is it equal? So he's just going to give you answers, then you'll say them, and then you can't do that. So we have 528, y'all have to figure out how you're gonna estimate this. Divided by 38, raise your hand if you absolutely love two digit divisors. Just love these two digit divisors. All right, if you do, you can do it in the standard way. I'm trying, I'm here, you know how to do division with two digit divisors. You do 33 times one, 33 times two, 33 times three. I'm gonna try and make it easier for you. I'm gonna try and make it easier for you. Jonathan, do you know what 33 times 10 is? Isaiah, whisper the answer to him. Yes, yeah, somebody whisper the answer to it. Jonathan, you got it? 330. So if I am doing 33 times 10, and I've got 330, I subtract 12, 8, 9, 9, 9 and then 198. So I've divided three, 33 10 times into... 528. Now I have 198. So what is an easy multiple of 33 that we could use here? I mean, we could do 33 times 1 if we wanted to. 33, what do you want to do here? 33 times 6. 33 times 6. And what is 33 times 6? 198. So then my answer is... 16. I just add those two together and I get 16. My last class, we did 10, then we did 3, and then we did another 3. But this is going to make, if you pay attention to this and learn this as a strategy, it's going to make your life, uh, let's see, 73% better. 73% exactly. Did you know that 98 and 6 tenths per, of data is made up? I am sure we rock and rolled some math. I am sure you loved every second of it. Let other people know. Share, like, subscribe, and share again. Please let the world know how much fun you had watching these videos.